is the color that can make a huge difference when you want to elevate your outfit. That makes every outfit elegant. This color or shade is white. These shades are timeless so that they never go out of style. This is why they are a staple or should be a staple of your wardrobe. I am going to show you three outfits that you can easily recreate with what you have in your wardrobe. Our first outfit. So this is an outfit that you could wear for an occasion in spring or summer to be good for a wedding or a christening or something really smart. The black and white monochrome is so timeless that it is a classic. So you can see here I've got a white silk camisole, a just an off-white blazer but that could be white, black trousers and I accessorized with silver. So this is a silver handbag. My shades Let's have a look. I think this work, and of course, off-white sling bags. So you could play with the jewelry, with other earrings, and of course, another jewelry, whatever you have in your wardrobe or that you want to bring into your wardrobe. Easily accessorizable. If you don't want to accessorize with silver, accessorize with gold. Depends, of course, on your skin tone. What suits you the best? Is it silver? Is it gold? You choose. Let us know below this video. You could ask me, Marianne, what about makeup? Well, it is for an occasion. So your makeup needs to be a little bit more soutenu, as we say in French, we said a little bit stronger for an occasion. But as you know, in makeup, I, know I am rather a minimalist, apart from the red lipstick when I shoot a video. So, of course, choose either to Bring forward your eyes or your lips, not the two together at the same time. So here it is uh, my lips, but you know you could have your eyes stronger, smokier, and have, for instance, nude lips. That would work as well. What happens if we change the jacket? I will opt for black. And you see, Ooh, you don't. So, it does change the look. So it's more black than white, but still very much timeless and classic. You could try another type of black, like a Chanel style jacket. Again, oh, I like it. <laughs> I really like this. And if you have an, an ivory jacket, or a white jacket like this, you know, that would go as well. Let's have a look. So I've got this, but this is more in the gold. So of course, if I was going to wear this jacket, I would change the accessories into a gold uh, so that you know it would look better. But you can see how that would work. Imagine that the accessories are gold and you can see how that works. And of course, every color, every other shade goes with black and white. Okay, now next outfit. The good thing about white and ivory is that they provide a neutral base for any other color. And for this outfit, I am staying in the off-white and the darker shade. So here, I just try something in the same family, in the light beige. So here is this outfit. So you can see that white is super elegant, even when casual. So I have a silk camisole white wide leg trousers in linen so i thought in the summer we all like linen so i did a linen light beige shirt that i can wear as a jacket it is so easy to wear breezy keeps you cool and for summer i think this is perfect but yet it gives you that elevated elegant style i always get asked marianne I am worried about the creases when I wear linen. What can you do? Well, you can now find some linen blends, some linen and cotton that do not crease as much as 100% linen. But anyway, let's call them smile lines for clothes. So what about accessories? Well, I'm 
fitting for the same color palette as the outfit. So we have an off-white in the middle and we have some like mid-brown for the back and of course my shades. So I think that goes really well for summer. And I also like the texture in the middle. So it is canvas, so perfect for summer. It gives that summery spring vibe to the outfit. One of the great things about white or ivory of white is that we can pair any other color and shades with them. We can vary textures, we can vary fabrics and add prints if we want to. So how could we change this outfit a little bit? Um, 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 this one. Right, so for the change I'm adding a strap silk and I think it looks amazing of course you know pull up your, your sleeves if you want to but i think that elevates it that adds a little interest to the to the outfit still remaining very elegant let us know what you think below and how would you change this outfit a little oh, i'm gonna try a red jacket so let's have a look at this I haven't tried it before, so I don't know what it looks like. Oh, oh, oh. So you can see, before I had light shades, the beige, that was very much in the same family. But now I'm, I am adding some contrast, just to show you that really you can wear any color or any shade. And also that's a different texture. Silk, I've got linen, and now I've got some kind of tweed boucle jacket. And it just does work. That looks really nice. So something for, for a garden party or something outside, I think that would look really nice. Do you like it? Let us know. For makeup, well, I've got a red lip, I've got a red jacket, I think it goes together, but uh, that might be too bright for you for daytime. So keep your, your lips nude if you want to and bring out your eyes. And with this jacket, I would keep jewelry to a minimum because it's, it's bright in color and also you have um, really large silver buttons. So already that acts like, um, like jewelry, if you like. I've only got just a simple silver chain here. For a third outfit, I thought I would wear a blue shirt because it's for you ladies who do not really suit white or off-white or ivory close to your face. Because of course you have to try each item to see you know, how it looks to you. So if, for instance, you try the white and it's not quite nice, it's maybe too brush, you could be, you might be better with ivory or, or cream of white. But anyway, if you don't like to wear any of them close to your face, just put something in a different color. So this is the blue shirt. And of course, I've got white trousers at the bottom. So let's have a look at the outfit. So you can see a simple but elevated outfit. Again, the white of the trousers makes it elevated. And I added simple cream shoes and a belt. So how could I accessorize it? I'm thinking a uh, sweater. Have you got a cashmere sweater? This one is ivory, adding a little bit of luxury because it is still um, a casual outfit, but still elevated. and. Cashmere of white, let's have a look. I love that look. It always gets a little bit cool in the evening and wear it over your shoulders or put it on. You can still have your shirt underneath, it'd be really nice. What else? Uh, oh, cream handbag and shade. So here you are, this is very simple. And let's not forget that you can, with a base like white and off-white, you can wear any shade. You can um, change the fabrics, add a print. This one is striped. But that is the thing. You can try things that you have never tried before. Have fun in your wardrobe. Have fun with your outfit and your style. Try new things. By having fun with your wardrobe, your outfit, your style, you will discover by yourself that white is the color to make you elegant. If you enjoyed this video, you'll love this one.